Welcome back. So today we're going to go over the fastest way to level up in Adventure Quest Worlds to my knowledge ever. So this is going to be the fastest way that has ever been in the game. Let's get into it. And your first step is of course logging off of the server. So click change servers or log out. Either one works. Changing servers is of course faster. Now you're gonna to want to go on a testing server. Sephiria is my testing server of choice. I think it's the only testing server up right now. Um, okay, so log back in. Pretty obvious. Go into the testing server because it had to switch the clients there. Wait for it to load. Now, once you're in the game, what you need to do is go through your bank, go through your achievement badges, and find all. Go through all these shops. Find all the items that will give you an XP boost. Right now, I already have them equipped, so I don't have to do this mid-video. My sword gives me a 25% boost to experience. So does my pet. Very rare to have a pet that gives you the boost. Um, so does my cape, uh, which you can farm for this cape. It's called the Cape of Awe. Uh, you can farm for that if you don't have it. You can also get the Armor of Awe, the Helmet of Awe. And I don't know if the Sword of Awe has, or yeah, the Blade of Awe is what it's called, has an XP boost on it. I'm not, I'm pretty sure it doesn't, but uh, maybe it does. Maybe you can check that out. Uh, my helmet also gives another 25% and my armor gives 10% because I was too cheap to buy the armor that went with this blade and the pet and the helmet. I was too cheap to buy that and I regret it. It was a thousand ACs and I didn't spend the ACs on it. I should have, but I could farm for the armor of Awe. If I wanted a 25% boost on my armor also. So altogether I'm getting 210% more. Just from the items I have equipped. Actually it's not 210%. It's uh, 110%. But I was, I'm counting in a boost. So just with my items with no server boost. I'm hitting 210% with a active boost. 110% uh, without the active boost. So... If you remember, you can get free daily boosts here. Uh, you can also, I think, buy boosts somewhere here in Battle on. You can buy boosts, or you get them with your upgrade package. So if you buy ten dollars or more, you get a few boosts every time you uh, spend money in the shop. Ten dollars or more. So you should have some boosts in your bank if you ever upgraded an AQ, uh, which most things in this game like you need up membership or ACs to get. So you've probably done that at some point. So you might have some boost, but if you don't, this still works. It's still 110% faster or 210% faster. Well, with well, it can be up to 225% faster, I think. Unless there's items that go above 25% boost. Okay, why don't, once you get out, it doesn't matter. Everyone will have a different percentage based on the items that they've acquired in the game. So once you have the highest percentage of boost you can possibly get, you're going to want to slash join eagles reach. Damn, that was fast. No loading screen at all. Testing server OP. Okay, so go to Battlegrounds. Pick the appropriate one for your level. It's the same. doesn't matter which one you go to. I'm going to go to 61 to 75. Now, click on this guy. Go to Quest. It doesn't matter which guy you click on. Uh, take the this one. So 20k XP, 20k gold. So you put a gold boost on too. And I think it's the fast way to earn gold and XP right now in the game. Um, and then I think if you grab that one too, I don't know, you grab all the quests and just turn them in as they turn in. I don't, I think, like, I don't think you can do two of these in one room, but I'm not 100% sure. So, once you do that, uh, all you do is you go up one room, and you farm in this room. God damn, these monsters have a lot of health on the testing server. <laughs> Holy hell. Okay, so you farm in this room. Uh, probably best to do it with a group of people considering the amount of health. Holy my health. Okay, uh, the amount of uh, health these guys have is pretty crazy on the Tesla server. So probably want to get a group of people together. And then once you get a few kills, you can go turn it in and get your 20k XP with a boost. We'll put up to 40k. Uh even more than 40 that, that's insane because a double would 100% boost would be 40k so you're getting a huge amount 210% which is 42k and if you have the armor also at 25% which I don't only have it at 10% you can get 50k xp per turn in 
Now the turns do take a while, um, and there are another, there are other bosses and stuff you can farm. And with the new level cap coming out, they're supposed to release a new boss. And Elena on Twitter said it was uh, going to have a farming quest uh, for XP to level up. So that might be faster. And uh, check my stream on Friday. Whatever I'm doing on that stream, that's going to be the fastest way. But if you want to be prepared, make sure you get all your items equipped and ready to farm XP. Uh, make sure you go find them. Uh, check your achievements because you could have new achievements. And you have, last time you checked, they weren't there for playtime and whatnot. And uh, make sure you got all the correct items equipped. And uh, yeah, good luck farming. And I'll see you guys all in the next video. Subscribe if you're not already. Leave a like if you enjoyed the video. And I'll see you guys all in the next one. Peace.